Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do another intro and this is a collab with the bunch of ladies I have done my Lucia project pan with. I'll just quickly run through the names so you know who I'm talking about. Mimi, she's a Swedish girl. Then I have Mirjaf, ASP from Sweden as well. Emily Glosa from Sweden as well. <laughs> then I have Alexandra from Panic with Alexi. Alexandra here on uh, YouTube. Then I have Nana from Denmark, Nana's Universe. Uh, she is on Instagram. And then we have Anna Katrine from Denmark as well. She is the new girl in this uh, small group of Scandinavian girls. And her Instagram is Panic with H mini. So yeah, I will have them linked down below for, as always and our thought process is we want to finish it by the Women's Day in 2018 and that is March 8. It is the International Women's Day so we really wanted to do something we all had in common and this was just a perfect project because our Lucia project plan ends uh, December 13th. So we have three months to finish these items and we have eight categories because we want to finish eight products and we all came up with uh, some categories and we have based all the categories on strength and woman power and so on so i hope you understand and i will just go through them with you and what i chose and why so the first product is a product that makes you feel confident and i have chosen my erased paste from benefit and i have this in my project mcfly but that ends here in december in like a week or two so i just really wanted to put this in this project as well because it does make me feel confident because i have bad under eye circles and you can, as you can see today because i don't have any makeup on i love cancelling them out when i have makeup on and this helps a lot with that so i will try to finish this i don't know if i can but i have done very good damage on this in like three months so i hope i can but at least it will be very close to being done by the finale So the second product is a product that makes a statement and i have always thought about my brows my brow routine is rather bold so I thought that would be a good statement, I guess. So I have my e.l.f. eyebrow kit in light. I don't know what my goals with this will be, but I think I can finish up the wax and then at least finish half of the brow powder by the finale. I really want this gone by for my collection because it's old and I really, really love it, but I just want to use something else and not have this kind of product in my collection anymore. So this is my statement product. The third category is a product that you feel confident that you will finish. What I've chosen is my Posy Balm from Benefit. It's a lip balm. And I finished my Benefit Balm in the Heavy Metal project and I finished that in like two to three months. So I thought this would be easy because I've used this just as much or more. So this is how much I have left. So yeah, I'm pretty sure I can finish this if I just use it every single day, morning and night. The fourth category is a color you feel good in. And I chose this lipstick. I just love it and it's a perfect um, lipstick for me. And it's a perfect everyday lipstick for my internship. In the bottom there is a lip gloss, but I don't know if I'm going to work on it here. You can take the bottom off. Um, it is the e.l.f. moisturizing lipstick in the shade Wink Pink. But yeah, I just feel very very good in this uh, lipstick. Then I have a color that are out of your comfort zone. I actually had a really really hard time picking this one. Because through Panda Palette I have learned to use a lot of shadows and a lot of different types of colors. So I feel comfortable in most of them. But as I went through my collection and what I wanted to work on next year comes from my Too Faced Chocolate Bar, for example. And I chose this, the pink shade Strawberry Bon Bon. I have a mixed feeling about this shade. I can use it in my crease. I can build it up for a pink-ish tone. But I can blend out my shadows as well with this product. And that is mostly what people do with that shade. But I just thought I would go ahead and try to hit pan on that shade right here. It is used, but you can't see it because it's Too Faced and it's the chocolate bar. I just need to work on this a bit more next year. 
I had a really really hard time with this product as well or this category it is something purple and the purple is from it's either from the flag or just a color that is associated with the day itself so something purple I chose the MDK eyeshadow primer potion the original I just love this packaging it's so so cute it is the travel size so it's the smaller size and it has a doe foot and I try to squeeze it up um, I will mark it after this video but as you can see it's only like half full or something so I'm pretty sure I can finish this by um, the finale I will try at least <laughs> I will try so this uh, seventh category is something you love and I love this color too for Maybelline it is the on and on bronze shade I just had pan in my rolling pan project pan on this item so I'm uh, I feel uh, ca quite confident that I can finish this by March because there's not that much product in it and I go through them fairly easy actually. So I will try to move this out. The last category is a product that makes something stronger. I thought that was a really great idea. I came up with that one and the something you love category. So something stronger could be a primer, a setting spray, something like that, a setting powder. You know, something that makes it something last longer. So I chose this one and it is the W7 The Matte Fixer Face Spray. I know there is like this much left in it, maybe less, but I don't use it. So I thought it would be a challenge for me. That's everything for this uh, intro. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you will check out the other ladies down below. They are amazing. I love them so much and they are such good panners, all of them. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you will stick around on my channel and please subscribe so you can follow along this project and the updates and the insanity that I have on my channel because I do a lot of projects and I just feel a bit insane at the moment, but I just needed some time off from studying for my exam next week. So yeah, this is a new intro and I hope you enjoyed and please take care until my next video. Bye guys!